Hi guys, Morgan of Feeling here, and today we are playing Odd World's New and Tasty. So if you've ever played Ibs Odyssey or Ibs Exodus back in the day, you'll love this game. Um, it's available on the PlayStation Network. I got it last year and I absolutely love it. Uh, I'll play on normal. I will play single player. So yeah, it's just an amazing game. If you've ever played it, you know what I'm talking about. But it can induce a lot of rage when you're trying to get past certain areas in the game so uh, for the first episode I'm just gonna you know do the first level which is Zulag 1 is it? I can't remember but here's just a little introduction to the story of the game so I'll, I'll shut up for this part they say it's the biggest meat processing plant on Oddworld Really a slave, like all the others. Until the beaches were through. We still made pear bite pies. I want a pie now. And we made some good scrab cakes too. He fucking scrabs so much. Oh, they're horrible I things. I had a good job, but that was before I knew how we'd make new and tasty. I was still to find. The truth, it turned out. Now that would blow my mind. The Gluckins were scared, cause prophets were grim. Paramites and scrabs had been turning up thin. As you can see, things are going down. They're so freaky. Watch. But Mullet was cool. Show him. He had a plan. It's great, like, character creation in this game. Each one is unique. What? It was us! I can't imagine Madokan Pops would be tasty. Because that would literally be a meat pop. I don't think meat pops exist. If they do, I don't want one. Cool. Alright. So that was just a short introduction to the game. Um, obviously if it wasn't for you, you probably skipped by it. I just had to be free. Um... Because it does get betraying when you watch it all the time and you just want to get into the game, you know? But I adore this game. Yeah, so if you've ever played it as a child, you probably want to buy this because it's amazing. There's a lot of hidden, hidden levels in the game and there's 299 employees to save or destroy. Whatever way you want to do it. I'm just going to play it for the crack because I've tried to save them all and... I just missed out on the trophy by like one or two, which I have to go back and find. I won't annoy you with that. I'm just gonna go in and just play it as if I was just playing for fun. But it will probably be really rage inducing. Okay, so, um, left analog stick to run, X to jump. 
Oh, that shows your health. Uh, circle to roll. Oh! That thing's fucking following me. Is it? I didn't know the thing was following me. That's really inconvenient. Okay. So, right here, under this first barrel, if you press square, is a hidden level. Now, I'm just gonna go around and dick about in it because I could not... It's really challenging to try and save all these when you don't have the... Um, the patience. But I'll try. Follow me. Okay. Don't die. Okay. Hey, yeah. Uh, no! Don't! Fuck it. It's too late. What the fuck? Okay. You. Okay, if you could just. Wait there. Uh, hiya. Follow me. And if you could just wait. Are you gonna wait? Are you gonna just just sit down and work? Okay, well I've just fucked everyone over, so. Okay, so. If you're pressing the L2 and R2 button simultaneously, you do these things called, you know, like an enchantment, like a homina homina, that's what I call it anyway. And uh, you then possess this slig. So the slig's are the dudes with the like lock faces and uh, they can shoot by pressing X and they have different, different um, sayings. So basically just say one of the Madokans were in my way. You press the down button. Um, on the directional pad and you know it, it tells them to duck out of the way so you don't shoot them I always forget that so and then if you at the end when you're finished with this dude um, simultaneously pass the L2 and R2 buttons again he explodes so there's an achievement for killing them 50 in different ways I think or is it 12 I'm pretty sure it's 15 uh, uh, everybody okay Okay, then you're basically your goal is to get them to these portals with all the birds, L2 and R2 simultaneously, and let them jump through. And we're done with them, and I'm done with this this secret level because it's it tests my patience. I have freed them all in this sector before, so I'm not doing it again. <laughs> For you trophy completionists, probably um, you'll probably want to. And like with most games, I love you know full Ging or full trophying the game. It's just this one is this one's a this one's a toughie. Okay, um, I'm gonna kill them. So so yeah, shoot your friend, explode yourself. There you go. <laughs> So press square opens up secret level, not secret level. Opens up the door. That's a save point. I don't know why I'm rolling. And square to enter doors again. This directory, when you open, press square to it, gives you a small um, map of the general area and tells you how many employees are in each thing. So the overall, there's 290 employees left in the whole of Rupture Farms and only 61 left in Zulag 1, which is where I am. And it shows you the locations of each one. So that's kind of handy, you know? I'm just gonna run through this part. So X and directional. That's what you don't wanna do. So yeah, it's the, the, the X and directional analog. That you wanna do. So, like that. Um, you can sneak by this dude by pressing L1, but I'm just gonna possess him. Because, I was 
probably another guy over here that I can kill. And boom goes the dynamite. Awesome, right. You could also have got another um another different style of killing a slug here if he walked into the electricity barrier here. He could have got electrocuted. Um Okay, we are gonna and right we do the humana hominas these two jump in here Oop, and we're going to jump in here fleeing deeper into the grinding lines than ever before but not long ago abe was just waxing the floors i can never read them in time i'm very proud of myself okay uh all y'all follow me so yeah that up there is just telling you how to talk to them differently there we go we're gonna get rid of these boom 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 I've only had three casualties. I'm very happy with that. <laughs> okay. So basically we want the slick to step onto that platform there and boom. Because we can't possess him when that big floating red uh, robot thing <laughs> is there. Okay, no. Wait. Okay, why won't you jump? Jump up, 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 up. Alright, I got these dudes killed. I don't regret anything. Alright, so I'm gonna let... Kill this guy. I'm gonna jump in here. Uh, the other dudes are dead, so, you know. Oh well, what can you do? I don't know what the ha what's happening with that slig on the ground. He's in convulsions. Um... The smell of searing flesh is nothing like the sweet, familiar aroma of his favourite tasty treats. <sighs> okay. Hey, Tom. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, that dude can shoot you. Right, what you want to do is you want to wait in these uh, air vents. And when you hide in them, if you move, even in inch while a slig is near you in them he'll hear you and he will shoot you so you want to wait till he goes out of sight you want to tell your man to wait there wait for the slig to walk by you I'm not going to jump up yet because I don't think it's enough time now I'm going to jump up there right so basically what you want to do is you want to wait for that slig to walk onto the platform or you can possess them, but I, I like the platform. It's easy, it's clean, it's quick. Everybody, follow me. Boom. There all y'all go. There's this one gone again. There you go. Well done. Goodbye. On your way. Save. Okay. Now, for those of you who want to detonate these, it's square. But you have to wait till they're in. And it's very tricky with the timing. It's lucky I saved just before that. Oh, it's so cute because little Madokans come clean you up after you explode. Yes, okay. It's if you want to save these guys, that's what you have to do, you know. You have to wait for a little birdie portal to come back. One, two, three. And skidoosh. Goodbye. See you next Christmas on the way. Okay. Um, save point. Jump up here. Want to close this. Do this. Your mom will jump in. Grand. Right, you want to time it so he's under it. So, now, yeah. Turn it off. And there we go. Oh, okay. I did not mean to jump that fast through there. Okay. That's another way they can die. They can die by being crushed by me or going in the grinder. So, you know, just keep it in mind. All right, so. Oh, fuck you. Okay, at least I saved here. 
Okay. Right. Right, we want to wait um, and get these by. I'll leave them waiting with your man here. I probably shouldn't have done that. Okay. Boom. And there we go. Where you can also crush um, him where those dudes are standing down here. If you push the lever up there, um, it will crush them. So. And there we go. Boom, boom, boom. Now, I'm not going to do it because it, it's very time consuming. I don't see the point. But if you go in this door, it will transport you to Zulog 2. Now, you can progress anywhere in Zulog 2. But there is one singular Madokan that if you miss, you won't get the full achievement for saving all Madokans. Um, but it, it takes you like through this little capsule thing uh, it's literally just to save one so I don't I don't see the point but it's it's if you're finding you're missing one that's where he is and I'm not really arsed because it's, it's a small little cutscene for actually traveling in the the transport you sphere and I just you know I just don't I, I've played this game so much I just I don't have it in me anymore the rage is Furnace and grind are still hot in his mind. He frantically flees from the farm's fleshy grind. I think that's what it said. I can never read these in time. Like, I actually have to, like, speed read them. Okay, so there is nothing down this way. Just a lot of show. Not yet, anyway. There could be later on. Um. Right. Right, so you trap him there. He can't come after you. Or you could kill him, whatever you want to do, you know? Now this part's this part's a tricky one. Right, so we get our little things. So these are little like bomb grenade yokes. And you can throw them. You aim using the right analogue, I think it is. Alright, let's see. I can't remember how you throw it. Oh yeah, and you you actually throw pressing R1, so. Okay, right, so I'm terrible at it, so. Oh, why won't nothing explode? I don't want to make a trip for more grenades. Right, I got one. Right, right, I'll try this way. We'll try getting around here. What? Are you serious, dude? Alright. So what you want to do is... I'll go down and get more grenades. You want to see where your man is right there. On the other side of him is a secret level. A secret level I am terrible at, but, you know, you have to kill him before you can go that way. Actually, can I just possess him? Is that an option? Oh, uh, you have to be closer. Okay. Okay, I could have just possessed him. Boom. All right, he's dead. That took a long time. Okay, so you want to jump up here, run, jump. Don't roll and jump because it doesn't work for me anyway. Now, there's a lot of Madokans hidden in this thing. Oh, I hate this part. Oh, fuck you! Okay, right. At least if you die here, you get, like, you're only at the start of the party, so. Okay. Right. So it's just all about timing. Okay, perfect. So when you get over, press this lever and it stops the spitters of death attacking you. Right. You have to be kind of quick up here. Humming a humming this dude. Humming a humming him. Humming a humming him dead. 
then jump down. Bye 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 bye. Be free, my people, and they're all safe. Cool. Oh, and then I just walked into a wall. Cool. So all you have to worry about now is. Please don't take me back to the beginning. <laughs> I done it. I don't care. I done it. I done it. That's all that I. I showed you guys how to do it. I done it. It's. <laughs> I'm not doing it again. All right. So if you want to get down safely. Um, wait for the lift. Boom, boom, boom. And shimmy on up. Okay. Alright, so that's the end of the first part. I'll just quick save it so I know I'm there for the next episode. Um, in the next episode, we'll be progressing to the stockyards. There is a lot of hidden levels in the stockyards, so you could miss a lot of Madokans if your goal is to save them all. I'll go through where the ones I know are. I think I know where they all are anyway. We shall see. Um, so yeah, that was the first episode of Oddworld New and Tasty. I hope y'all liked it. I kind of went very fast through the first episode because it was just an introduction. I liked to explain roughly where things were that I didn't get to. Like that one lonely Madokan who I didn't see the point again. I didn't try to save everyone because that's not how I'm going to play this one. I, I'm not playing it seriously because I'll get really angry and I don't I don't want to do that. Not yet. Um, so yeah, if you liked it, you know, like, subscribe, all that jazz. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. So. Uh... Oh, 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 oh,